buy glass. Another gift. I want to say that's for Sigrun. Or. Yeah, it is, because we uh, talked to her about it. And thus I cloak my. She was, be she was saying something about it. It'd be cool to uh, have something like that. farther on ladder, so you can get off my back ah uh, we have to go kill it I don't think it's gonna drop the loot until we do no it's behind us or what said that one over there was the experimental subject. This just looks like Sigurd now. I'll get on it. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> Whatever you say, Salraka. Stash of supplies, and I'll have my stuff back. Of course, that's the last thing you find. Uh, this looks like two dead ends, so we'll go this way. A little backstabbing never hurt anyone. <laughs> Deposit. What's it take to get that cold heart beating for Ogren? Ah, oh, not this again. Come on, don't tell me you wouldn't like to feel hot blood pumping through those dead Legion air veins. Ogren, I don't want to have anything to do with you or the words hot and pumping. <laughs> oh, I'll get through to you, lady. Ogryn will just keep ramming up against that armor of yours. Go away, please. You're embarrassing. Alright, and I messed up by equipping her. There we go. I was like, hold on. She's missing a weapon. I keep like feeling like my mic is out of position. Shit. I think that's the way to go since it gave us a save right there. Let's try this direction.
well. Can't remember. Okay, it's shortcut on all of them, or that. Yes. Don't kill me, please. It's not over. It can't be. Funny how that keeps happening. I'm wounded. Do something about it. I actually think this is the way we were supposed to go, though. Uh, to get out of here. So, make sure, yeah. The saves, throwing you off sometimes. See what we got over here. The dragon tamer. And there's that dragon egg. Nice. Just call me the That one, that's why. You are Can I get you Die. More blood. Probably could have looted it. And then it would have been no now problem to target. The wedding ring and leg crusher. Which isn't all that great. His weapon was literally called Leg Crusher. So my weapon should be up ahead. Really hope I'm not like missing something. Architect's room. Okay, it's probably in here. Is it? No. What about this one? There's a key, but still not it. 15 willpower. That is not bad. Or magic. 25 stamina. Alright, we got a letter A. 
right here. Letter from the architect. Utha, I know this has tested your patience. You first gave your blood years ago to farther our, com our common dream. I know at times it seems we're going nowhere. Trust me, Utha. I echo your frustration. Vigil's keep was a setback, yes, but minor. I intend to keep my promise to you. Perhaps you should venture above ground. The green rain fresh air would do your spirit good. I think Utha was the, uh, right when the architect first appeared, was that female dwarf we saw with. Which, if I remember correctly, was involved in one of the novels. Oh, okay, here we go. I remember now. It's this chest right here. All my stuff. And they give you uh, a vendor, I believe. Had that helm like the whole game. Apparently, I don't have the raw strength for that. Well, I have it now. Uh, that has to be the boots and those clothes. There we go. Do all this work uh, on my gear, and then we don't even get to use it for the first set of battles. You are not supposed to be here. Were you captured as well? Once. I made a deal with the creatures, and they set me free. I bring them supplies, they give me gold. Check what he has real quick. Nothing crazy. You return. Okay. Will you trade supplies at a discount? Very well. I see that you are in a bit of trouble and I am not heartless. But if you truly wish my help, I would suggest you escape this place as soon as you can. Okay, let's see it again. You return. Would you consent to trading at Vigil's Keep? Vigil's Keep? Hmm. That is the Grey Warden's Keep near Amaranthine. Yes, I know it. If there is coin to be had, Armas will be there. We will meet again, if you survive this place. Okay, we actually already seen him there. That's why I said I don't remember finding this guy. And now that it said the name, I remember the guy standing uh, between the shopkeeper and the bomb dude. <laughs> but as I said, this awakening expansion can be a little bit buggy with things. Alright, do you know what's going on? No. All I care is that the Darkspawn honor our arrangement. Questioning them would be inadvisable. Why would the Canari work with the Darkspawn? The Coon is a lie. I am Tal Vashaw, outcast. My life is my own. I do not help the Darkspawn. I help myself. Nah. 
That's kind of why he looks kind of similar to Stan. But that can get a little bit confusing when it comes to the following games. But I'll save that for another time. Don't have any bearing on what's going on right now. What if the Dark Spawn corruption affects you? It will not. I have been promised protection. Okay. Uh, why would they promise that? I provide a service. I think I said that one. The coon is a lie. Yeah. I am Tal Vashaw, outcast. Must be on my way. Go then. Go then. I'll say nothing of you to the dark spawn. Thanks, man. And thus I cloak my naked villainy. All right. Now I believe we just have a big fight, and then we're out of here. The architect. Two of these guys. A little backstabbing never hurt anyone. <laughs> Let the other one go. Alright, everyone, let's. I'm pretty sure they'll go for this one first. Come on. Heal her. Ready. Fine. My strength is failing. Damn dragons. fight but we got I'll it. Get on it shock treatment don't really use any lightning damage
is she with that monster? I must get to her. We'll find another way, I promise. They're dark spawn. They'll head underground to the deep roads. They always do. The home of the children of stone. Yes. They say wardens can sense dark spawn even deep beneath the ground. I would join the Grey Wardens. Give me the ability to hunt down these monsters in the deep. So that's what I was talking about earlier. The whole, uh, it won't make sense to the story. Bringing her into the joining, but it's a way to make sure we get everyone properly. The joining could kill you. I am not afraid of death. I will pledge my service to you in exchange for the powers your order can grant. What say you? Very well. Welcome to the Grey Ward. Ma Siranas. Shall we go then? I've had enough of this place. And we get the quest again. Kind of funny. Okay, it just pops up right there. We don't actually have the quest since we actually did do it. Because I think we did it before it was even a quest. Not bad. That might outweigh what I'm wearing. I don't know, I'll, I'll keep the backstab damage. Other characters could use it though. And now this is locked, you can't go back through there. Ah, I'll wait and look at everything later. Back of the keep. Alright, anything back here? Doesn't look that way. All right, all right. Can I get you a ladder so you can get off my back? Straight to the world map. Unfortunate. No, it is lost to us now. There is no point in returning, Uther. Your former comrades are impressive. They will be difficult to convince. No, Uther. I will fulfill my promise to you. All is not lost yet. Come. We must prepare for battle. Now, he's actually referring, uh, referring to the Grey Wardens right there as uh, old companions. Well, let's go ahead and head back to the keep. Um, if, oh, did we run into something? Um, she actually knows Duncan, if I recall from the books. I never actually read the books, but I've, what do we got? Canary mercenaries, a bunch of mercenaries. Um, but I've kind of, you know, read the main bits of story to take from it. Alright, let's just go over here. Do the usual. Attack speed. Got it. Time to get And 
if I recall too, Duncan actually met um, the architect. And uh, I think that was the bit where Kaylin was actually there. If anyone knows otherwise, feel free to put it in the comments saying I was wrong. But I want to say that's how Kaylin and Duncan actually knew each other and why he respected the Grey Warden so much is because of the journey into the Deep Roads with Duncan and got to see firsthand how skilled they are. Anyway. Like, I'd actually like to read the book sometime, but I've never really gone searching for them. There's a couple of them. I know there's one with, uh, for example, with Wynn. And, um... Oh, I'm drawing a blank on her name right now. The, the golem, how at the end, uh, during the meeting, she said she was going to go venture somewhere, uh, taking her to see if they could restore her old self. Anyway, enough of that. Let's go ahead and move forward. Let me get into lore. It's not within here. Deals with it, though. So, at least I'm staying somewhat on topic. Right, no scene that time. But we should be able to uh, make this other piece. Yes, Commander? I have everything you need for the Dragonbone Sword. Yes, yes, we can begin. So momentous. Where to begin? What type of blade would you like? Oh, I don't remember which was better here. Uh, let's give the great sword a look real quick. The blade, it's balanced. Your thoughts? Uh, raw power, unstoppable swing. Certainly, Commander. And for the forging itself, I have Fomari enchanted materials aplenty, and the bone is very receptive. Hmm. Do what you think it's best. Now, let me commence. I Look forgot about it going into it like this. Work. I should have, uh, Use it well. researched it a little bit first. I can't, can't recall what each one did. It does change the sword. Wow. Wow. But let's just compare this first this sword to begin with. Amazing. Real quick, let me play with this a little bit before I actually choose which one I want to go with. Okay, took a look at them and this one by far is my personal favorite. So it's definitely the one we will be using. Go ahead and throw it on him. Let's get a look at this thing. Looks alright. We'll get these runes out in a bit. You're back. You need anything? I found ore deposit. Oh, this will help a great deal. Wade, the commander found a silverite deposit. Amaranthine abounds with mineral wealth. Master Wade has more than he needs to equip all of your men suitably. Thank you so much for finding all this dreary metal. Haran, you must be happy. Ecstatic. Now, now, no more time to waste. Got her low. Now to figure out what spell to give her next that I will not use. Give her some health. Uh, 
sure. Let's just go with that. I think I have our tactic set up anyway. Yeah, it's custom. You're back. You need anything? Come back soon. What about you? If you find anything else, you let me know. I doubt we will at this point. Trade here is good. Thank you. This is the guy I was saying about. The lads are hard at work. You'll have your explosives. <laughs> Wait, I thought. Did I finish it? I guess so. Okay. Still got search for more merchants. Makes me think I might have missed one somewhere. I pity the siege crew that tries to breach our walls. Ah. Did you tell Valana that dwarves are born as little rocks? <laughs> no. Maybe. Yes. Yeah. Valana takes herself too seriously. And come on, it was funny. <laughs> All right, it was funny. You should have seen her afterwards. She was huffing like a constipated Bronto. <laughs> Hot. <laughs> oh my gosh. I shudder to think what would happen if you hadn't cleared the oh, basement. Oh man. If Dark Spawn attacked again, again burning it would villages. be wide open. So common now. Refugees Is this the what roads. it was like during the blight? Tales or... Okay. Let's see if we get any messages. And worse. Commander. Just give me a moment. Yeah, nothing. So, let's head inside. We should have some more gifts to give out. Uh, save. I uh, should have some more gifts to give out. And probably talk to Alana. And see where we go from here.